What's happening, everybody? Street Riders here, and I'm together with Sinful Duck and Marcus, and uh, we're going to start a new little series, a little collabo. And what the hell do you have glowing by you? You got a bat. You dropped your bat, Sinful. Yeah, I know. Um, yeah. We're going to do a new series, and we're going to follow the notes that the NPCs leave behind. Marcus has uh, figured out the order in which they work, so we're going to follow Marcus in. We're going to bodyguard for Marcus, and... Uh, see what happens along the way because you know somebody's going to try to jump us but now it's going to be three of us yeah so the basic thing around here is that the notes actually form a story or maybe well half or 75 percent of the notes form a story of one family around in colorado and uh the fact why nobody never wants to read the notes because they think it's just something the uh, the game makers have put in there to show off with the uh, with the note uh, the, what is it called like a, a game aspect of notes but actually they form up a small kind of a campaign or a story and I figured out the order and we're going to read the whole stuff to you and hopefully it's going to be at least semi interesting yeah, Marcus came to me with the idea, and I was like, uh, yeah, it sounds good. I will happily produce that, so here we go. And we got Sinful Duck with us, because why would you not want Sinful <laughs> running back backup for you? Where the hell did you go, Marcus? I totally lost you. <laughs> We're downstairs. Yeah, yeah. Did you guys go down? Want... Shit, you guys yeah, are moving too By the way, did one of you guys pick up my bat? No, didn't you pick it up? <laughs> No, I it stole, disappeared. I, said, I stole it, and you were just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. There, there it go. is. <laughs> Don't touch my bat, Marcus. <laughs> <laughs> That's dirty. I love it. Marcus uh, Marcus asked one day in one episode we were playing, he says, I don't know whether to pull out my python or my anaconda. And I was like, dude, they both sound good. <laughs> <laughs> I had some I had some guy today on uh, make a comment this morning on my uh, one of my Minecraft videos is all is this guy gay? And I was like, dude, I was like, I'm not gay. My boyfriend is, but I was like, you know, <laughs> don't hate don't hate on me if you want a little bit of it. <laughs> I was like, I'm taken. <laughs> oh my god! All right, it's over on top of the construction site. That is the first NPC note, and um. I'm creeped out right now because I can't see anything. Yeah, it's yeah. really dark. It's dark, dude. I can see, like, where'd you go, Marcus? I went up the stairs. Went up the stairs. Sinful and I are uh, doing recon as we're running here and losing yeah. track of you every once in a while. <laughs> yeah, it should be right, right. inside this crate. Has, does anyone have a flashlight? No. Oh, my God. So here's the first NPC note. I'm going to read it to you. Well, got a pen and some paper in an office below. Figure I'll write something to my wife or anyone else who might know her or want to know my story. My name is John Thomas. I lived in Falls Day with my wife, Ellen Thomas. I was a construction worker by day and a family man by night. I had a truly wonderful family. When the riots started, though, we got separated and I haven't seen them since. The plan was to meet there at my work if we got separated, but no one never came. Now our town is overrun with whatever the hell those things are, and I've been living in this crate for two weeks now. But, I, but I'm getting pretty short on supplies. I miss my wife. I will, I will think, I think I'll go looking for help. Nice. All right, that so, was probably a bad idea. Yeah, that is probably a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually, if somebody just run around and just saw a bandit, I would go, yeah, help me. And that would be like, that bandit would probably like actually stop and would be like, dude, do you even know what this is about? Like, okay, if somebody, I would actually like, like in Daisy, like people ask for help in Daisy, right? Like, I've seen people coming up to me and asking for like blood transfusion and shit. But like, in this game, it's, I mean, you think this is actually more of an FPS than a survival game? What yeah, it's more FPS. It's more yeah. action-based. Yeah. 
I'm just thinking we gotta go and find that chick, dude. That's all I'm thinking. Like, come on, chick, a, a, a lone chick in the apocalypse by herself. Three <laughs> three dudes are coming to meet her. <laughs> yeah, like <laughs> that would make a hell of an adult film right there. <laughs> the story could get dirty quick. <laughs> Yeah, let's just cut it. Right here. Before right. you know it, it's just bam, chicka, bam, chicka, bam, 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 chicka, bam. <laughs> Is that a pickaxe street? <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, I gotta change my brightness actually. Yeah, I was gonna do that too. Okay, I don't wanna do that because if I put my brightness on brightness like that, then I'm not gonna see anything. Hey, juice! It's mine. Well, that's too okay. bright. Change my brightness. That was way too bright. Yeah, that's the cool. brightness in this game is tough to use because it just turns everything white. Yeah. Yeah, it's actually smart, so nobody can abuse it. That Where'd way. you guys go? I'm hiding in a bush. I can see somebody standing right there. Don't I can't see you guys. <laughs> I'm like totally lost. Help me, I'm in the dark. I'm scared. Okay, maybe I have, we have to go by the road. Okay, everybody get back to the construction site. Let's go by the road. We can oh, there's, see. there's Marcus. <laughs> Got scared by myself. Didn't know Street what to do. You're scared of the dark? I was about to curl up in the fetal position and to start rocking. <laughs> All right, where's right, Sinful at? Where are you guys at? We're up in the in the construction, like right where we pretty much were a second ago. Yeah, I can see a guy with a pickaxe, and I'm not going any any closer. <laughs> That's me. There you guys are. Uh, we're. Yeah, I see you. Now, this is the situation where you use flares. All right. Now, there you are. Now, let's go. All right. Next destination. Okay, so where's the next spot we need to go? The hut? Uh, no, it's Fallsdale itself. Oh, Fallsdale. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's actually a note left by the, the dude's chick. So. Ah, oh, so we're not going to meet the chick this next or this episode. Damn it. Judah? Actually, I think. No, it's not. I did not. I, don't I, know. Okay, I just, I like just really didn't want the pickaxe to go to waste. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got a dude in the global, but it was a while ago saying anybody at Fallsdale. Oh, that's the one guy. Okay, Ranger Station. So he's probably already on the move again. Yeah, but he may be heading up this direction. He could be. Yeah. No, so but if he I'm gonna get off the road a little bit. You know what? That's probably a pretty good idea. Okay, now this is the worst, worst situation to go melee in, like ever, because I can't see anything. Like that bush right there could be a zombie. I wouldn't know that. Guys, yeah, sinful. Did you read the comment from the one guy um, on our squad play from yesterday that said if we would have ran closer to the mountain, we would have been out of the city and the zombies would have left us alone at the end of that episode. Oh, really? I was like, damn it. <laughs> I was like, yeah, actually, hella that, late with the pro tip, man. That would have been yeah. great if we knew that. <laughs> yeah, it actually works. But the trick nowadays when they increase, they actually, again, they increase the zombie count. And now the trick is actually to get off the... Careful, there's a zombie on the road here. Like four of them. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, we're going to start running into him in the grass here, too. Okay, everybody just go crouching, okay? Yeah, let's um, not no. be too stupid about it. Let's, uh, uh, there's try another one in. here right in front of me. Okay. Better get my pickaxe out. I hate the darkness that is actually dark. Like, I like the semi-darkness. You can see stuff, but, like, stuff can't see you. I like that, but, like, now I can't, actually, I can't see anything. Let's see, I got, I got two zombies right here. Yeah, I'm right behind you. I'm watching them. This might actually be the most shortest episode Street Fighter has ever done. Nah, right, so dude, where do we need to go? We're armed. Uh, we're gonna go up to yeah the, the road that goes over there up. We're gonna go to that place. Okay, I'm gonna take this zombie right here. Get on! Yeah, nice. that was. That was <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I hella like ran into you. <laughs> I was like, oh shit, hey! 
I saw that pickaxe come into my screen and got scared. <laughs> You're like, oh my god. <laughs> Dude, it is freaking so dark out here. I'm Let's actually using my uh, my viewing angle to my benefit right now. I'm sitting up high in my chair to get the uh, washout, and it's yeah. helping. <laughs> yeah, look at there you taking go. out zombies like a pro. Yeah. Right, this chick is on next. It's on! Yeah, you like hatches to the face? Here, I'll bag her for you. Don't worry about it, I got it. Oh, yeah. Yes. 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 <laughs> All right. Well, should we, uh, there's another one here in the shadow. Yeah, right in front of us. Here, let me get her with the pickaxe. Let me get her with the pickaxe. Come here, bitch. No, oh, yeah, you like that? Now, somebody please cover our backs, okay? Because Yeah, I'm watching. Let's hit the store because we got to get some drinks. Yeah. I have two juices, but I'm hoping we can uh, collect a couple of more things along our way. I see some water. All right, here's some water, Sinful. Why don't you go ahead and grab that? I'll grab some I'll of the food. You guys grab grab anything you can. Sure. I don't even know if I have a a spot for it. A bag slot, yeah. There's some painkillers. There's a bag over here, but I can't reach it. Let's see. Damn, I need, yeah, I need food and water. Okay, well, there's a bag of chips and a chocolate bar right here. Oh, it's a medium backpack too, man. How do I get up here? There's hella food back here too. Actually, I got enough stuff oh, to drink. Actually, I'm gonna take this. I gotta drop something, I think. Drink that juice. Anybody need a 9 mil mag? I do, yeah. Dude, I do, I do. Okay, give it to Marcus, because I got like four, three or four. There you go. All right, let's okay. see. I need to eat something real quick. Let's eat that. Make sure you grab those painkillers and all this food over here, too. I got to tell you guys, I'm horrified right now. These zombie noises are like... It sounds like they're all... It sounds like they're aggroed all the time and nobody's coming in. Yeah. I know, it's Man. almost like cry wolf sometimes. You're like, are they are they aggro at me or are they just making sounds? <laughs> yeah. You're hella trying to get that backpack, huh? Can you, I want it. <laughs> can you, like, jump? It. Here, see if you can jump on me or something and, like... <laughs> <laughs> I can get, like, halfway and then it it goes out of, out of range. Sucks. <laughs> I was trying to get a good visual on that, but I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why they spawn things like that where you can't. Here get comes zombies. zombies. Here comes zombies. It, guys, dude, are you stupid or what? I just grabbed it. Here, here you go. No, I tried to grab it too, and it wouldn't let me. It yeah, was like too just, high for me to get. If you go right below it, you can never grab it. You have to be. Like, oh man, no, it, I don't even have a way to pick it up. Just drop something and. Uh, then fill it back up after you drop. How do I change it here? There we go. Alright, we ready? Oh. Yeah. Let's do it. Awesome. Well, Marcus is beating zombies. Alright, where are we off to, Marcus? Lead the way, Marcus Finn. Actually, the post office is the closest. It's actually a little bit before the outbreak began. Is this note? And I'm feeling uncomfortable with a zombie right here. There's another one behind. I'm getting in the Take post it. office. <laughs> Come on okay. in. Okay, my bat's not killing this guy. There we go. Hey, we got an anaconda clip over here. Sweet. I'm, car I'm carrying an anaconda if you're not. Yeah, I've got one too, but you can have it if you want. All right. <clears throat> It'll pretty Thanks much come down to whoever needs the gun first. So anybody will switch up with them. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, somebody, somebody, cover me now. Um, next note. It. Can't believe what this world is coming to. I was driving to work this morning, and some drunk asshole in front of me slams his car into a power pole. 
I get out of my car trying to be good Samaritan, and the jerk shows his appreci appreciation by taking a bite out of my freaking arm. Nice. So here I am, writing on paper like a goddamn caveman with no power because of some asshole drunk and no cell serve. Because of some asshole drunk and no cell service because of the stupid freaking mountains. Nice. Uh, so that and, then, dude... and then it said uh, down on the uh, next side of it said first world problems. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I'm guessing that dude died. Yeah, that that's not. But the, I'm saying the chick is the same chick. Mm, I got like... this. I got this. Get in, Her bitch. You, I cannot imagine how much that thing hurts when it goes Taking a pickaxe to the freaking head, dude, that would suck. You got one chasing you. Oh, no, she's on me now. I'm actually scared because we're gonna come up to the moment where there's. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta beat a bitch. <laughs> Alright, we're back on our way. So now we have to go to the hut, right? Yeah. Uh, no, 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 we're going up to that place. There's the chick's note. And then, then is the hut. Marcus has just got this all freaking figured out. I like it. Like, what does it say? Am I, am I a real genius in this game? Or it, do I not have anything in my life to do? <laughs> I'll just say both. <laughs> I'll say both, too. <laughs> No, the notes the notes are interesting just nobody ever takes the time to read them and I don't think anybody has a series going like this I mean like you said it's almost like the uh, it's like the Easter egg campaign in the game that nobody pays attention to yeah that's what I'm talking about I was thinking that you might actually get some extra extra likes and views for this game. Come here, buddy. all right taking this guy okay I think we're gonna Go somewhere. Um, I don't know where to go right now because there's zombies. Let's go by this road. There's at least a. I know it might be time to pull a gun out. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Well, we can pull the zombies kind of one by one and start clearing them if we need to. That's true. Aggro one. We got one, we got one walking up behind us. Shoot. I think we can get to the I house without even messing with this them guy. though. Right. Nice. Uh, it's in the it's in the RV over there. Somebody's gotta cover the guy who's in the RV because they can enter the RV. And if we all get trapped in there with a horn in our tail, I've been there. I lost a shitload of stuff. All right, we'll, we'll give that job to Sinful because I'm right. I'm opening the notes and uh, and so the reader or the viewers can read along with you as you read. Okay. Yeah, I'll I'll hang out by this car over here. Watch out! There's one right in front of the RV. Yeah. Got a dog shit eater over here. Yep. I'll bag her. <laughs> nice to have a purpose for you too on this campaign. You're the bagger. <laughs> yeah, I, I record and uh, teabag. <laughs> yeah, no, street cover us. No street, uh, duck. I'll stay out. Us. So here it is. This has all been happening too fast, as if getting separated from my husband hasn't been hard enough. Nathan then tells me that my John has died and I should come and stay with him. I've thought about going to the construction site to see him if he really didn't make it there, but I'm too afraid to go on my own. Nathan has gone for a quite a while. He went out for supplies hours ago and he hasn't returned, and there is moaning and scar scraping outside the RV. The keys aren't in the RV. I have nowhere to go, and nothing I can do to protect myself. I don't want to live in this world anymore. It's because she didn't have the three musketeers following her, dude. Mm. <laughs> she knew she... that. She, that 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 wanted to get out. Yeah, she's dead, huh? No, she's not dead. I'm telling you, she's not dead. No, <laughs> dude. Have... Uh, this series is still gonna have no a happy spoilers, ending, man. dude. Don't no worry spoilers. about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so don't ask me for spoilers, dude. Like, it's supposed to be so that people think the chick is dead. It's, it doesn't help if you say the chick is dead. She just said, man, she wants to eat a bullet. I hope she's not wasting them like that. I know, I dude. That's, that's, uh, that's 
wasteful yeah. and not very smart idea. I'm gonna punk out a zombie. You know, it sucks when you get hit in the head of the pickaxe, doesn't it? But yeah. Yeah, actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna one start right in your face. Give me really sick conversation right here. Okay, if you had to kill yourself, what would be the way you'd kill yourself? If I had to kill um, myself, how would I do it? Yeah, how I'd have street do hit me with a pickaxe. <laughs> 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 I'd probably cover myself in butter and light my shit up. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe some heavily fragrant lotion or something that would just freaking burst into flames. <laughs> if you're going out of this world, you're going out with style, right? No, I'm going out sexy. He's gonna go out smelling good. <laughs> <laughs> Have my chest hair all lathered in lotion. <laughs> Dude, awesome. Shut up. Awesome. Pictures, dude. It's horrifying. <laughs> well, you don't you don't want to see a big six foot five uh, tall dude weighing at about 250, 240, 250, just covered in lotion or butter. Stop, well, that sounds right. good to me. Yeah, it sounds pretty good to me too. <laughs> With a loincloth. Oh man. Yes. <laughs> I am thinking right now. What am I doing with my life? Talking to you. You love it. That's what you're doing. <laughs> All right, let's. Okay, just kidding with you guys. I think I'm gonna end this episode when we get out of town, just uh, to let everybody know, because we gotta keep these episodes within reason. So let's watch this zombie uh, get beat the shit out of. Oh, who's hitting me? God damn it! God damn it! Oh, I need it. I need a freaking painkiller up here. <laughs> I'm getting low. Yeah, the zombie. Somebody handle that. <laughs> oh. I did not realize you pulled a gun out. I was standing right behind that zombie. Oh, God. <laughs> not good. Oh, I'm getting hit. Okay, everybody get into the post office. It's like a safe place. Get in there. <laughs> I'm going, I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> Just get, get over to the other side of that. Duck, get over here. I'm coming. <laughs> Run, boy! <laughs> Get your ass back to shelter. <laughs> All right, let's take those guys out. Back up, bitch. Back up, bitch. AKM whoopings on your ass. Oh, where's the other one at? All right, well, I'm going to end this episode, everyone. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll be back with some more of the, I guess we're going to call it the Note Diaries. Uh, another time. Thanks for watching, everyone. You guys want to sign out? Yeah, yeah. sure. Check friend Erky Finn ninety seven's channel. He's the, he's the greatest dude on planet. True that. Uh, Doc, of course, but uh, yeah, check out his channel. Uh, yeah, Doc's turn. Yeah, I'll just say uh, until next time, guys. Take it easy. See you later.